Welcome, welcome, welcome to another episode of 3D Boxing Podcast. We are back with the Boxing Bookie. We're going to get into the big one, Charlo and Canelo. I'm going to show you how to make money on Charlo versus Canelo. Uh, but before we do, please like, share, and subscribe. Follow 3D Boxing, 3D Boxing Blog on all forms of social media. Uh, the Boxing Bookie comes at you for every fight. We are showing you how to take down the house and make money on boxing. No matter what, these bookies have no idea what they're doing. Uh, and we're going to show you how to bring down the house. Uh, we, we, so I'll stay with us. And right now, we are killing it. Uh, we are making money on, on, on hand over fist. We are making money on, on everything. Um, okay. Um, also, please subscribe to the other channel, Texas Boxing Scene on YouTube. All proceeds go to Autism Research and Recovery. Um, again, that's Texas Boxing Scene. Um, completely dedicated to Texas Boxing. Let's get into today's fight. Yo, I, I'm one. I, I don't think this is a mismatch. I, I think um, Charlo has a shot in this fight. You know, I think Canelo, even though they're about the same age, has aged much worse than Charlo. Um, I, I think this fight goes the distance. Um, I, I think Canelo fades as the fight goes on. I think uh, Charlo get stronger as the fight goes on. We saw that in the Castano fights. We saw that in the Tony Harrison fight. We've seen Canelo fade now in the Canelo fight. We've seen him fade in the John Ryder fight. I, I just don't think he's the same fighter. Um, so I, I got a couple of uh, bets I want to make on this. I am going to pick Canelo Alvarez to win the fight, right? I, I think Charlo does have a chance, and I, I think the odds um, are a bit high, uh, are a bit too wide in favor of Canelo. Canelo is a minus 400, Charlo's a plus 300. Um, I, I don't think it's a terrible bet to, to bet Charlo, but, I, you know, he's got a lot going against him, like the judges, and I do think this is going to go the distance. Um, I think Charlo has a game plan to win. I think he needs to outwork Canelo. I think he needs to show that activity that he showed, um, the activity that he showed in the Castano rematch. I think he needs to keep that, you know, 50, 60 punches up per round. Um, I think he needs to win the battle of the jabs, and I think he needs to get on the inside. And when he does, he needs to land an uppercut, and he needs to work Canelo. He, the, 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 the way to beat Canelo is not to run from him, right? Like, that's not going to work. We saw, you know, Saunders and Caleb Plant do all that. It's, it's not going to work. Eventually, you're going you're gonna to tire him, and he's going to catch you and break you. So you got to be able to stand in with him. You, you got to have a jab. You got to have a little bit of power to keep him off you, which is what Bavol executed perfectly. Um, and I think big Charlo could do it better just because he's naturally bigger, but I think little Charlo can do it. It's just not going to be, it's just not going to be quite enough. Uh, but this is a good fight. Um, I, I don't think this is, like I said, I don't think this is a mismatch. I, I think Canelo is going to win the fight. I think, you know, uh, Charlo is going to have moments early and late, uh, but I think that the middle rounds is going to be dominated by Canelo. And I'm expecting a 116, 112, 115, 113 kind of decision. I expect a, game competitive decision i do think um you know um canelo can take some some steam out of him it's gonna be a battle uh you know Charlo has that really good jab to the body he can land that a bunch of times he could really take some steam out i don't think steam out of canelo i don't think it's inappropriate to think that Charlo can pull this off at the same time i also wouldn't bet on it right like if i had to favor someone i i wouldn't bet i wouldn't put these odds at minus 400 for canelo Maybe minus 250. These are really high odds. I'm still going to take them. I'm going to show you uh, right quick now how I'm making money on this fight. Again, I don't gamble. Uh, I'm going to use DraftKings.com because I like DraftKings.com. I think it gives you pretty good odds, and I think it uh, it's very user-friendly. Uh, but I don't bet. If this is your thing, I'm going to show you how to make money. I make money consistently. Follow me. You will make money consistently. Um, with me. We did it last week um, on, on all the fights. We did it the week before that. I told y'all to pick Roman Cardenas uh, to win. He did it. Um, we just make money. Um, and I'm going to show you how to make money on this fight. And 
let's get let's get to it. Let's pull up. You know, I've been binge watching Canelo and Cholo fights. You can see that. Um, trying to get this down. All right. So I kind of like this bet. Canelo Alvarez to go over to 10 and a half rounds. And I'm taking Canelo by decision. I kind of want to put this in here too. Canelo by unanimous decision. Um, we'll get to that later. Um, so here's what I would do. Canelo Alvarez by decision. I really like that bet. I'm going to pay almost even money. I get to go over 10 and a half rounds. I like Canelo Alvarez on the money line. I don't like it that much. It's a one-time bet. I don't like the odds. And that's a one-time bet. Okay. So we got four bets here. All right. Um, two, uh, one two times bet, which is Canelo Alvarez by decision, because I really like these odds. They're basically paying even money odds. Um, Canelo Alvarez, two hundred dollar bet will make you one hundred eighty one dollars and eighty one cents. So you walk away with three eighty one eighty one. Over ten and a half rounds, it's going to pay you uh, about a third. So he's going to walk away uh, one a one times bet. You're going to walk away with one thirty three thirty three. Canelo Alvarez on the money line, you're going to walk away with. $100 on a $400 bet or $25 on a $100 bet. Canelo Alvarez to win by unanimous decision. Paying pretty well. It's paying in your favor. And I, I, I that's my bet. So Canelo by unanimous decision pays well. That's $225. Um, I don't love these bets. Um, they get me a little – because I, I don't love the odds. Um, this is pretty good odds. Uh, on Canelo win by unanimous decision. I, I think that's what we're going to have. So basically, so let's just recap this. Um, you're gonna have a two times bet, right? You, you, you're gonna bet roughly five hundred, right? Two, three, four, five, um, and you're gonna be able to make uh, one eighty one, two eleven. 265, 365, about 387 on a $500 bet if Canelo wins by unanimous decision. I'll, I'll break it down for you real quick. Again, one more time. Um, Canelo Alvarez, by decision, is going to pay you uh, by uh, – Canelo Alvarez, by decision, pays you almost even money. It's going to pay you 181 or 1.81 on a two-times two bet. Uh, over 10 and a half rounds, it's not paying great, but I do think it goes over 10 and a half. So let's take that. That's going to pay you 33 33 on a $100 bet. Okay, it's going to pay you, you know, 30% basically. Canelo Alvarez is going to pay you 25%. going to pay you a quarter on a, on a $100 bet. Again, these aren't making a kill, but while I'm making some money, the bet I really like is this one Canelo Alvarez by UD. Uh, it's plus 225. That's uh, plus 125 to pay you 225 on a $100 bet. It's going to pay a, a buck and a quarter. So these are the odds. You're not making a kill on this fight, but this is how we're making money on this fight. We are going to make money on this fight. We're going to make almost $400 on a $500 bet. Walk away with our initial investment of $500 and another $400. Um, so I, I like this. This is pretty good. Um, these are good odds. I mean, these, these are the, all the best bets we can make on, on this fight. I know you all want to bet this fight. Um, it's a big fight. I understand. This is how we're going to make money on it. Let me know what you guys think. Leave your thoughts, comments below. Please follow me again. And and share your your your, your victory stories. When, when I do hit, share it. You know, let everyone know how you got that information. The boxing, boxing bookie told you how to bring down the house. Let's do this together. It is September 27, 2023 from Texas to the world. Thank you and God bless. Don't miss a tweet, post, story, or video. 3D Boxing is on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook. Hit the subscribe button now to stay inside the ring.